Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Kevin O'Leary says tornado cash sanction is a worthy price to pay for institutional adoption. Canadian businessman and crypto shark tank investor Kevin O'Leary has said that the recent sanction of the coin mixing service tornado cash is a worthy sacrifice to pay for the industry to enjoy institutional adoption. Tornado cash sanction is a price to pay. On, Mon on Monday, August 8, the U.S. Department of the Treasury's Office of Foreign Foreign's as Assets Control, or OFAC, sanctioned Tornado cash for facilitating the laundering of over $7 billion in digital assets. Days after the Dutch government announced the arrest of the 29 years suspected developer of Tornado Cash, while well, there was a mixed reaction to the sanction, O'Leary believes it's a price to pay on the road to a more regulated crypto industry. Crypto will benefit from more regulation. In a Saturday discussion on crypto banter, O'Leary, also known as Mr. Wonderful, stated to Tornado Cash is part of a crypto cowboy culture that shouldn't have a place in the industry. According to O'Leary, O'Leary there needs to be a more regulated environment for the crypto industry to reach to receive big inflows from institutional investors and excerpt from his discussion reads I'm tired of this crypto cowboy crap uh, I want to get involved in a regulated place where we can bring billions of dollars to work because I work in the regulated world he adds the these investors are not going to touch Bitcoin as long as crypto cowboys are riding the fence. On the flip side, the sanction of Tornado Cash has torn the crypto community, with many debating the move is against anonymity and open source development. Why you should care? Mm. Kevin O'Leary he chose the views of many experts that there that there needs to be significant change in the crypto industry for it to support mainstream adoption. Get the full details of the sanctions in Tornado Cash Crypto Maxi Blacklist by U.S. Treasury Department. Read Batterian's defense of Tornado Cash below. Violetic battery in defense tornado cash once used it for Ukraine dona donations. Read what circles C circles CO has to say on the sanction below. Circle CO Jeremy Lair calls for legal framework and policies after tornado cash uh, fiasco. <coughs> on Sunday, August. Uh, 14 hackers uh, exploited a book in a newly deployed liquidity pool of Akala and Mainty. After realizing the network had been explo exploited, the Akala team disabled the transfer functionality of the erroneously minted AUSSD, still on the Akala press sign. The action from the Akala team was unable to stop the AU, AUSD from losing the one-to-one -one pitch it had held with the US dollar since February when it launched it. Another free for all exploit. A wallet address indicated to belong to the hacker still holds approximately the hacker allegedly swept a small fraction of the stable coins for Akala's native token ACA and four other tokens. However, on-chain 
autopsies revealed that other people took advantage of the bug to steal thousands of dollars worth of DOT from the liquid liquidity pool. With people joining in, the Akala hack now resembles the free for all nomad exploit, which saw over 190 million stolen from the decentralized finance or DEFI protocols. On the flip side, Akala dollar or AUSD is now fighting to recover its dollar pitch and has can it mine percent in in the last uh what uh two twenty four hours to trade the two d price card for aka dollars or AUSD. Why you should care the depicting of AUSD add more pressure on stablecoin in your when USD USDT USDC D A D A I and a couple of others have at a uh, points lost their USD pitch. Read about the norm made hacking. Hmm. Okay guys, thanks for the watching. Sorry for my mistake. Don't forget to like, uh, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye bye.